So before I start this q and I'm just gonna have to do it. There is a brand new Combat Zone Wrestling World Heavyweight Champion, and his name is Leo Rush. So apparently Leo Rush actually won the CZW World Heavyweight Championship, and that is great. Doesn't deserve it, earned it. So on Friday I asked you guys to ask me questions, and you left a lot. I was like, wow. And we're gonna start off with Instagram questions first, because I was just on Instagram. You can even see the little WWE thing with Nikki Bella. And if you're not following me on Instagram, just uh... You should probably do it. First up, would you rather be there when CM Punk returns to the WWE at the Royal Rumble or not be there if he returned at WrestleMania in Chicago, but you get to see Rusev wrestle in the main event of a pay-per-view? I don't get to go to WrestleMania in Chicago, but I get to go to a pay-per-view with Rusev wrestling in the main event. That one. Do you like the idea of great balls of fire? Balls on fire. These balls are on fire. Who are the next tag team champions for both brands gonna be? Uh, for Raw, Sheamus and Cesaro. Da 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 da. And SmackDown, there's not gonna be any other ones because it's gonna stay. The Usos. Potato LOL said the Celtics are gonna win. I shouldn't have been so cocky. Who do you think Brock will face at Great Balls of Fire? It's either gonna be Seth Rollins or from one, actually, that came from BCN Rollins. Um, one, I don't like your face. It might be Seth Rollins or Finn Balor. So if I'm gonna pick between one of them. Big cast. Broken Dawn 36146. What are your goals for the future? I'm new here and I haven't seen any of these, so sorry if it's already been answered. Just ignore it if it has. I feel like that has been asked before. I can't remember what I said then, so I'm just gonna say it again now. Assuming you're talking about YouTube, over the summer, it's gonna be real lit. There's gonna be a lot of vlogs, a lot of really cool stuff. For the month of June, I'm gonna be uploading every single day. Cause this month, gotta get through finals and stuff. Probably gonna go to Philly's Comic Con cause I heard Alexa Bliss and Seth Rollins might be there. Going to a lot of independent shows, going to a lot of WWE shows, going to Battleground, maybe SummerSlam, I don't know, maybe. That's right, keep wasting your money in WWE garbage. I gotta go there, man. I, I ain't wasting money. What's your name? Your name is Sting Fan Rem. I don't know if you subscribe to me or not. You have this coming on yourself. Shut up, you pathetic mark. I'm obviously joking. Have a nice day, man. Love your face. Was there any wrestler that you met that just surprised you? Like, when I met Mark Henry, I was so surprised that he was that nice. Uh, Sheamus, when do you think Leo Rush will sign with the WWE and where do you think they'll start him at? Well, he just won a CZW World Heavyweight title. I'm assuming he's not going anytime soon, which is actually really good because I think he should get more time on independence before going to WWE, so he's like a really big name when he gets there. That way they don't have a reason to like not push him. The show I went to, I met Rey Mysterio, he was there and I actually asked him about it. Like, would you go to NXT or 205 Live? And he was kind of just open to either one. So, for WWE's perspective, they would probably do 205 Live. If you could make a channel with any WWE YouTuber, who would it be? Interesting. There's a few guys on YouTube I talk to pretty consistently, and uh, I don't know. I mean, who would I pick out of them? People are uh, Deshaun Rocks 10, Wyatt Fan, Brandon Hodge, Brandon Dillon. I talked to BCN Rollins, but I don't really like his face that much, and like, I don't think I could stand being around his face that often, so it, it, could, it definitely would not be him, which is obviously a joke. Please subscribe to him. He only has like 300. He needs more. Do it. Actually, I'm going to leave a link to that in the description. It'd probably come down between Brandon Hodge and Wyatt Fan, and I'd probably go with Brandon Hodge. Honestly, I talked to Wyatt Fan, but like, I don't really like him like that. Like, he seems kind of weird. What's your favorite thing WWE does? Wow, that's a very thought-provoking question. You can go into like some detail with that. They take these larger-than-life athletes and put them into a soap opera-like drama, depicting one as a villain and one as a face. You don't know who's going to prevail on top in the end of the feud. They get into the ring, false finish after false finish. When their bodies are aligned, all for the entertainment of the little boy sitting up front that really wanted to come to the show because his dad has never took him to a wrestling show before but all he wanted to do was see our truth wrestle one time and then there's a little girl sitting at the top of the stand she's been to a couple wrestling shows before she knows that this is her time she wants to do this as a full life career and you don't know who's gonna win this match who's gonna prevail on top i like the pyro the pyro is really cool yes yeah, shiny what's your predicted match card for great balls of fire god i love that name great balls of fire Creative geniuses made that, man. Probably a 60-minute Iron Man tag team match between Enzo and Cass and the club. And with that, I'm actually gonna switch over to Twitter for a second. Who is Brother Wyatt? Put a sensor on his face. I don't wanna see that on my screen. Kanye or Big Sean? 
I mean, let me ask you this quick, I'll get you off my screen. Uh, Kanye, you have to push one, fire one, and retire one. AJ Styles, Cesaro, or Sami Zayn? I think that's my favorite question. Okay, AJ Styles, he could retire. He's done a lot already. Like, he can retire now, so it'll be great. Yeah, let's let's retire AJ. Let's push Sami, and let's fire Cesaro. Let him go back to the Indies. Make himself, like, I want to say great again, because he's already great. Make WWE realize why they should have gave him a world title a long time ago. Or, you know, still do it now, because it's Cesaro. He deserves it. Bianca! Hi. Do you agree that purple is the best color ever? Yes, it is. I do not have it on me, but my weightlifting belt is purple, which I think I told you already, but I'm telling you again. Oh, actually, because I go to Catholic school, Jesus likes you to dress up and stuff. You don't know how to tie a tie. I'm just kind of teaching you right now. There you go, kids. Purple tie. Emily. Who? Why do you have to be such a mark? Am I really the mark? Or are you the mark? I'm just talking about wrestling on the internet. You watch wrestling, watch me talk about wrestling on the internet. You're the mark. I'm just joking. Have a nice day, Emily. I should probably pick that up. You going to Extreme Rules? Yup. Gonna be lit. Why do you like wrestling so much? And do you consider getting your eyebrows done? No hate. Just, you know, asking. I'm sorry, do you, would you like to take over this video? I'm joking, but um, my eyebrows? No, don't really want to. I, I like my eyebrows. Funny story about this eyebrow. So, I was two years old, I thought I was Superman, jumped off a couch, coffee table corner. It's my life. Why do I like wrestling so much? Mm -hmm. I made you upset about the Celtics, didn't I? It's all good. First, laugh, last, last, first, laugh, last, last, first. First class. They lost. They saw Rusev's name again. Here we go. Who is your favorite superstar right now other than Rusev? What kind of question is that? It's like saying who's your favorite best friend besides your best friend. What kind of question? No. It's Rusev. What? No. I will not. John Cena. Who's your favorite past women's wrestler or Jillian Hall? Do you like Seth Rollins' new finisher? I really don't. It does not look realistic in my opinion. I know that's something that Kenny Omega does as well. And I know someone's like, oh my god, you just insulted Kenny Omega. My god. I'm sorry. I'll go sit in the corner for my opinion. I'll just, I'll just be gone. It's stupid. Is there a way for the wizard Brandon Hodge to get Wyatt Fan to take off his clothes and run across the WWE stage? Probably give him like a free Braun Strowman autograph or something. Wyatt, if you want to do that, can you have like a piece of paper that's like glued to you that says some squeeb on it? Because I appreciate that. What's your favorite WWE item that you collected over the year? Uh, it's probably this. Oh, it's my list that your name is now on. How do you feel now? I also have a signed Fruity Pebbles box by John Cena. I don't know where it is, but it's probably that. Thank you guys for watching the video. If you really enjoyed, make sure you like, comment, share, and always subscribe. And in case you don't know what subscribe means, it means subscribe. Make sure you like, comment, share, and always subscribe, which means subscribe by definition is a noun. And we outie.